Well, it can be tough to be a girl. One South Georgia organization is helping make a little being a little girl a little easier. Girls on the run in South Georgia. They're helping girls in third through eighth grade be more physically active. That's right, and they also empower girls to be the very best versions of themselves. ABC 27's Ariel Schiller explains how the program achieves those goals. Girls on the Run is going into its second year in Thomas County, and it's already growing. Rena Crew, site liaison and head coach, helps start the program in the county with two teams of 20 girls. Now we're up to four teams of Girls on the Run, or Heart and Soul, um, in a matter of a year. So it's pretty exciting to see the number of girls that we're going to get to impact and hopefully continue to grow over the next few years. It's not just Thomas County that's seeing growth in the program. According to Crew, the South Georgia coaches training at the end of January had 60 coaches, 25 of them new to the program. Girls on the Run is a program for elementary schools in grades third through fifth. They are centered on caring, how to be compassionate, how to be a positive um, part of our community. So, um, and we do a lot of our lessons are geared towards um, positive self-talk and how to, when we're having a bad day, how can we talk about it and then what can we do to do positive things in our life to help us kind of turn that around. Then there's the Heart and Soul program that works with students in grades 6 through 8. Two programs created to help inspire a healthy lifestyle. It's not just about the emotional and social part, but now let's add that physical component and just how to teach them to be healthy and just get moving. Logan Herring is the 8th grade school counselor. She also coached for Heart and Soul in the fall. She says even if some of the girls in those programs are not runners, they're still able to finish a 5K by the end of each season, which can help them in the long term for building relationships and confidence. Knowing that they can be successful in things that they work hard for, and it also helps give them the confidence to build up other girls, and they can go out there and say, you know, I was nervous at first too, but I was able to accomplish this, and so can you. Helping Herring accomplish her goal of having better connections with her students. It was just another way that I could get more students involved and find them some way to be connected at school too, you know. And then I'll see girls that I coach in the hallways and like, hey, Coach Herring. So I think it just helps build that sense of community that counselors are looking for and teachers are looking for. In Thomas County, Ariel Schiller, ABC 27. And the Sparkle and Shine Girls on the Run 5K, which is a 5K to end each season for Girls on the Run, will happen April 15th at Wiregrass Georgia Technical College. If you're interested in volunteering or participating, you can go to the South Georgia Girls on the Run website.